Okay, Devon OS, almost known as CoreOS, is based on Android 12. The latest build, the first initial build, which has a February security patch, is here. Official version and unofficial version, some available for some of the devices. I'm using this official version on Redmi Note 10 Pro. As unofficial version, it's available for me a tool device also, and some other devices also got this update so far. Let's just talk about some default things as quickly as possible. We have the Pixel Launcher pre-installed as expectedly. Pixel Launcher is what you get mostly in all the custom rooms so far. Pixel Launcher is not so bad. If your device has the Google Pixel apps already available, Google apps already installed, you might always get the Pixel Launcher pre-installed most of the times. If we talk about the quick settings panel, there are no major changes. This is not about unique custom room, etc. It's almost same like other custom rooms. There might be some few changes and some few changes in difference in, in features or something else but there are no major ones out there. If you want to enable, add or remove any tile from here, simply hold or not only hold, but only one click and the dial will be added. You can see if you want to check out the power menu here, it's a little bit small and advanced power menu is also included. Wide background as expected, which you can customize, of course, with the help of Project Themer. How you can customize with Project Themer, I have a video available. Make sure to check out that. I will share with you the video for sure. Talking about some other things here quickly, you can see we have the settings look, the UI is almost same like other customs, but I saw wallpapers and style, etc. Everything is almost kind of same. There are no major differences or changes in the default settings app, no UI changes at all. It's almost same here. But if you talk about the things, for example, the battery, one thing is a little bit unfortunate that you can't wipe the stats, unfortunately, wallpapers and styles, which means if you talk about the Monet theming, it's there and it was expected. It's working perfectly fine. Security app also security things also has a fingerprint only no face unlock and no app lock and else the gestures etc almost same kind of things available here like the other customers this is about the revenue's first look if you talk about the customizations or features which you get here which is absolutely almost same there are no major differences but i think i need to show you those two so move on to this Raven house where we have a customizations for you the features available for you for example status bar lock screen and hardware status bar includes some network traffic indicators which means you don't need separate app to enable the network traffic monitor on your status bar including that you have some heads up customizations less boring heads up is one of my favorite ones i always use this thing status bar icons which you need to enable or disable from your status bar and including that some bit of extra options like clock customizations the volte icon customizations are also present volte icon if your device has a sim card which supports volte you will definitely be grateful for some cool and interesting volte icons which you have lock screen gestures lock screen charging info some other options like in call vibrations and fp sensor and some bit of extra things other things are kind of same these are the things i just wanted to let you know this is all from a short simple video goodbye over the edge feel like i'm floating through the air